I'm going to look at the features of cooperative society. Cooperative society have the following features. One, membership is unlimited. That is, many people, as much as possible, so to say, can join the cooperative society. Membership is unlimited. Two, liability of member is unlimited. So it's just like so trade or partnership. Should the business fail, they will not only lose their share capital, but they will also sell their personal property to pay for the debts of the business. Three, resources are pulled together based on individual's capacity. So it means that all members do not pay the same amount of capital. Capital is paid according to the financial capacity of each member. Four, yes, a minimum shareholding by members. No matter how small the capital is, there is a minimum. So that if some other members pay very high amount of capital, others will pay very low amount of capital. But usually there is a minimum, there is a line drawn. If it is 2,000 Naira minimum, everybody must pay at least that 2,000 Naira minimum. 